Okay, I've got a property update for you. Uh, this one's all stripped out, ready to start uh, start bashing around. There's there's quite a lot of rubbish and muck and mess in this uh, this property, so it's all being cleared out. There's a skip out there. That's the second one. So we've got rid of an awful lot of muck and mess. It's all out. Staircase is uh, coming out and moving, as is the front door in this property. So that used to be a, an airing cupboard with a, um, an old boiler in there. That's all been taken out, as you can see. Took a little while, I've got to be careful doing that. Bathroom's all out. This property never actually had a toilet when the last person was living there. They were using that, which pretty disgusting to clear out, but uh, that's all done. This bedroom all cleared. The windows are on the order, the staircase is on order, there's a new staircase going in which will it'll finish about here and then this here will be a brand new room. That window will be a little bit higher, the same height as that there, so it'll be more usual. Then it's bricked up, so that's like a half landing window. That'll be bricked up, then a new window here. This makes kind of a kid's bedroom in here. A decent size sort of second bedroom and then the main bedroom there. Also, by taking these stairs out of this space here, instead of having a winding staircase, um, you get a bit more of a feeling of space up here because you've got a double width. And that used to be uh, a big um, wall up there, so that's a, a nice landing space. Um, this used to be a wall up here as well, so that's all sort of gone, it's opened out already. And then when we go to the kitchen, you'll see that we get to have all the space underneath the stairs here going into the kitchen and if I walk round to the other side you'll see we're going to incorporate a little storeroom that's here as well all this all this jungle's coming down and then there's a storeroom to the right hand side as we look at it now of the kitchen and all that will be incorporated so the whole kitchen will be bigger and also under where the stairs is so just a little simple change really does um, make a lot more space all because the house when it's built uh, here, you can see that's where the, the boiler used to be when this house was built. Um, it would have needed a big airing cupboard, big space for all those tanks and things. Nowadays a combi boiler will uh, fit in a cupboard in the kitchen, so uh, you really do gain a lot of space. and well, A whole extra bedroom and a, a bigger kitchen just because of that. Um, front door is going here and then you go up the stairs from this point here. So um, we've hit a few snags, they're sort of sucking their teeth a little bit here. Nothing major. We haven't got any gas at this property, I've got to get that organised. Simple enough to do, we're on with it already. Uh, and also, just come through into the, uh, this sort of the kitchen. Um, the electricity has been cut off on the street, which is not something that ever, anybody ever let us know. Um, it's caused a little delay. Uh, we've got over it today by bringing a, a generator on site, so we'll, we'll get back up to speed today. Uh, the guys, are, obviously they couldn't do any work, didn't have any electricity for tools or anything, which was a bit unfortunate, but uh, we're going to miss a day on it, and, uh, and now they're back to work. So, um, Next update in, uh, in a week or so, and all of this lot will have been ripped out, everything will be clear and clear, um, wall will be blocked up, so the door will be blocked up, new staircases going in, and then the place can be plastered out, ready for refitting. That's the end of the update.